What is up everybody, Hungry Cabbygon here. This video is brought to you by buyptcgocodes.com. They are sponsoring us. Um, they've also given me a nice little uh, promo code. So if I want to add these to my shopping cart, yes, I want 50 Darkness Ablaze packs, please. Oh, look at that, I already have 50 in there. And I've already applied my, uh, <laughs> my uh, coupon code, Cabbygon5, to get 5% off. So if you're interested in codes, please check them out and tell them I sent you. What is up everybody? Hungry Cabbygon here. I've got some more mystery packs for you today. I've done some nice new artworks for you. I say nice in inverted commas. They're not that good, but <laughs> I thought I would just give it a go. So we have a Jirachi. I just did heads because I thought that was easier. So yeah, excuse me for that. Uh, we've got a Mewtwo. This does not look so good. Definitely not my best work. We've got a, uh, I was going to say Jirachi, Victini. It, it looks okay. Not too bad. Not too bad. I need to get colors. I really need to get colors, but that's going to take a long time. We have a Rotom. I don't hate that one. I think that's all right. I think that actually looks half decent. All right. And we have a Celebi. Eh, looks okay. It's kind of looks like an onion, which is what he's supposed to look like. Got a Ho-Oh. Looks not too bad. Kind of a bit chunky around the, uh, the neck there, but looks all right. Got a Lugia. I think this is probably the best one. Looks pretty good. <laughs> and uh, we have a weird looking Zapdos. So I'm trying. I'm trying my best. Please excuse me. They're not so great, but... We're, we're trying as hard as we can. So anyway, um, that is what we have today. Yeah, let's do a bit of a shuffle, uh, not a shuffle, a bit of a fan out. It's hard to fan out the... Yeah, I'm gonna have this many. Five is kind of a good number to try to fan out. Let's do it like that. Yeah, it looks okay. Not really. You can't really see anything, but you get the idea. Let's have a look what we got. These are the 500 yen ones. Same ones that I've been getting a bit. The ones that I draw on usually are from the same machine. Let's see what Lugia has for us. Let's go. Ooh. Okay. What do we have here? Oh, we got another one of these uh, V start deck EBs. There's only two cards. Could be a good sign. Oh, all right. That is a very good start, the boss. I think I need to go and sell this quick smart though because the shiny star V set is gonna have a reprint of this card. So it's definitely gonna go down in value. It will still be worth a bit just because it is like such a universally played card, but it will most definitely go down. It happened with I'm trying to think who, with Cynthia, it was like 20 bucks, went down to like nothing. Guzma as well, same sort of thing. So it's gonna happen with this one too. It won't be worth nothing, but it will be worth a lot less. I've sold some of these before for like 25 bucks. So it definitely is not gonna be worth that much anymore, but we will see what happens. All right, um, I guess we gotta go this way. All right, what do we got in here? We've got a Silvali. Not a shiny one, just a regular one. We have a non holo Tapu Koko, which came from deck build box or something. And ooh, a Jim Promo Sonya. I don't have this. That's cool, it's a reverse. Ooh, it has a mean dent on top of it though. That's a shame. Anyway. We have a Sonya. It's pretty cool. All right, let's sleeve up these. I'm going through a lot of sleeves with these mystery packs because you get three hits, seems like, in each one. So we are using a lot. And Tapu Lele has just obviously not playable anymore in standard, but I remember a time when you could sell this for more than 50 bucks if you had that, so yes, has fallen <laughs> fallen considerably since that high benchmark. Actually, let's sleep up this as well. 
I had a bit of a look online. I saw some people selling these for like 15 bucks. So I was like, okay, I should probably sleeve it. I've got four of them now. I don't think that's a realistic price, but that was a price that I did see people actually selling them for. So you never know. We'll keep it in good condition as much as possible. Okay, what do we got here? Got a like and right. We're getting like good cards if it was a couple of years ago. Buzzwell, another one. And then we have got a Toxtricity VMAX. I do have a lot of these. I say it all the time, but I have so many Toxtricities, so many VMAXs, so many full arts. I really hope that it becomes good one day because I have a lot. So we'll be laughing if that happens. Seems like it's not so popular though. I know they wanted it to be. They're kind of pushing it. He's on the, the pack art and everything, but yeah, never really took off so far. And you never know. These things turn around. We got a Rotom. Let's see what's in the Rotom box. Uh, this way. No, wait, this way. We got Flygon. We got a flag on, and oh, that's pretty good as well. Nice, we got Eternatus. Very good. Worth a few bucks. That Eternatus, we'll take that, most definitely. And yeah, I kind of feel like sometimes it's not even worth leaving up half these GXs and stuff, but we'll do it. Keep it in good condition. I don't want it to be like ruined. We'll just add it to the collection, which is growing very rapidly <laughs> with these mystery pack openings. All right, we have a Victini. Let's see what Victini has for us. Uh, this way. No, wait. Yes, this way. We have a Greninja. We have an, um, Oh, what are you called? Why does the name escape me? It's one of the ones that I always get. And we got Talonflame. Now I just... All I can think about is what is your name? Eh... Uh, what are you called? Uh, that's really annoying. I'm gonna remember randomly later I'm sure and I'll be like uh oh, duh it's obviously this one I apologize Japanese name is Denji Denji Denju Moku if that helps not really it's not at all similar to the uh to the English one we got Jirachi e Okay let's go Oh, okay, that's nice. We got a, I want to say Showers, because that's the Japanese name, but it's a Vaporeon. We have a Stack Attacker, and we have the birds, the three birds. Undos Tres. Looking pretty good. Very nice artwork. This kind of had a bit of a moment where people were liking it, but... I think it's really was only good in expanded where you could use what was it the ho -Oh ex and you could like use ninja boy and then switch out and have all the energy because three different energy types is is a bit is a bit much i think honestly it's it's a bit too hard to to deal with all right we got the weird mewtwo We've got the Espeon and Deoxys. That was from a deck. Oh, that was our good card. Whoops, I did it the wrong way. Although, we do have a VMAX, Copperaja, <laughs> and a VMAX of uh, the Squid, Malamar. That was not a bad pack. I mean, this is, is from a deck, so it's not worth anything, but it is a pretty decent card. Alright, we're just kind of piling everything up. I will quickly reorganize at the end 
because I'm just literally just slapping everything down. All right, let's go. Celebi. Last pack. Um, this way. Okay, we have another Lycan Rock. We have another Buzzwell, and then we have another Toxtricity V Max. Was that exactly the same as the other one where that happened? We definitely got all of these cards already today. We'll take them. I mean, Buzzwall was like a really good card. And Lycan Rock was a really good card. I don't know, like, even if you played an expanded, these cards just like not gonna cut it, I don't think, at all. Not enough damage, not enough HP, like yeah, they just just not really gonna cut the mustard anymore. Alright, let's see what we got very quickly. We have a lot of stuff. Okay. So these are what I would consider to be the good stuff that we got. Which is not bad. And then we have got, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, uh, nineteen. 20. All right, so we, we got a lot of stuff out of our packs, so pretty good uh, pull rate, that's for sure. But did we get our money's worth? Maybe not today. We'll have to see. The, the boss is good, but definitely not worth as much as it was. The rest of, a lot of these GX is kind of not really worth anything, so we probably didn't really get our money's worth, but we did get a lot of hits, so we'll take that. It's pretty good. Uh, anyway, let me know what you think, guys. Let me know what you think of the artwork. Check out the channel for more videos. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and we will see you in the next one. Take it easy.